The plants are one of the most beautiful species on the planet but there are many species of plants that are poisonous and can cause serious complications. In this video I'm gonna tell you about the 10 most dangerous plants so let's begin the countdown. White snake root it originates from eastern part of South America. White snake root can be found in forests, wooded pastures and thickets. It grows on fertile, moist soil exposed to direct sunlight or in the partial shade. White snake root is poisonous plants that can induce death of humans and domestic animals. Flowers of white snake root are gathered in dense, rounded clusters that can be seen at the end of the branches on the top of the stem. Hairs on the surface of seed facilitate dispersal by wind. Suicide tree. The toxin in suicide tree has been called the perfect murderer weapon. Sadly, the suicide tree earned one of its nicknames due to the fact that toxicologists believe that it's used by more people to commit suicide than any other plant on the earth. According to a decade-long study published in 2004, this tree kills especially large number of people in Indian communities. Water hemlock. Water hemlock is a relatively tall plant measuring approximately 90 to 200 cm in height. This white flower has dome shaped compound umbils of small white, radially symmetrical flowers. Water hemlock has two types of leaves large, prominently forked, toothed lower leaves, and compound upper leaves with small, lanceolate, coarsely toothed leaflets. The stems are smooth, fibrous, and robust and are finely patterned with vertical magenta streaks. Corn Lily The inflorescence of corn lily is particularly large and distinctive. A thick branch spike bearing a dense cluster of many dozen flowers, each with six white petals, greenish glands at the center, six stamens, and a third prolonged pistil. The plant is also notable for its high toxicity, harmful to all animals which ingest the flower and even to some species of pollinating insects. The flower blooms in midsummer and inhabits mid to high elevation regions of the Pacific and Rocky Mountain states. Monkshood Monkshood is a genus of about 250 species native to the moist mountainous regions of the northern hemisphere. They are often found in rich, moist soils along streams or in open woods. Monkshood flowers and leaves resemble larkspur. To differentiate, look at the stems. Monkshood stems are not hollow like those of larkspur. That being said, as beautiful as the flowers are, all parts of the plants are poisonous, especially the roots. Nightshade Tomatoes, potatoes, eggplant, and peppers are commonly edible nightshades. Many herbs and spices are derived from nightshades including pepper, crushed red pepper, chili powder, and paprika. Nightshade plants contain different types of alkaloid compounds, food factors that cause physiological changes in the body. The origin of the name nightshade is not clear, but some suggest that the name describes how these plants prefer to grow and flower in night and shade. Oleander Oleander is a evergreen plant. This plant is native to Morocco, Portugal, China, and Mediterranean areas, but it has been naturalized to almost all countries in the world. Oleander is one of the most poisonous plants on the planet. Despite the fact people cultivate and create new varieties of oleander due to ornamental formology of these plants. Fruits of oleander is called capsule. Each capsule contains a large number of fluffy seeds. Rosary P. Rosary P is a woody vine. It originates from India, Indonesia, and Africa, but it can be found in tropical and subtropical regions around the world. It can be also seen in many gardens where it is cultivated in the ornamental purposes. Due to ability to easily escape from cultivation and successfully invade nearby areas, Rosary P is classified as invasive seed in many countries outside its native range. Rosary P is also known as crab's eye due to a round shaped and unusual coloration of its seed. Rosary P is a valuable source of food for birds which play an important role in dispersal of seed in the wild. This was it for today guys, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and leave a like for this video. See you in the next video.